What's up guys? Dustin you here. Back with the Florida Panthers GM mode. And last time we won the Stanley Cup ho, 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 in six games. Wow, it was phenomenal. We won the Stanley Cup. We won uh, game six. 4-1. Not bad. And basically we're getting into the draft now, into the offseason. Um, where are we? The draft is right there. So uh, I'm just going to sim ahead, I think. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do. Amazing job this year. You did great. Thank ya. Wow, really? I'll offer you to renew all the sick for us for another four years. I'll ex be expecting 36 wins. Wow. So we finished with 49 wins. We, we won the cup. And, uh, yeah, that's ridiculous. Okay, Florida, four years. That's crazy. Florida, four years, 36 wins. Yep. Obviously. I turned firing off. So, But apparently you can turn, you can turn firing back on, which is interesting. I like that they left it in there, so... It's like if you have a terrible year, you could just turn firing off and then just avoid being fired because, you know, you don't want to be. You're like, eh, maybe not, <laughs> you know? Um, yeah, but I, I can't believe we we freaking won the cup. That's so good. And, like, our, uh, our salary cap is, like, $10 million under the like under the highest point. So um, I don't know how many players we're going to have to re-sign. We had to re-sign, like, our whole team, which is crazy, so... Uh, all right, so ca Cup uh, Champions, Florida Panthers, Grand Rapid Griffins won the Calder Cup. They took out our uh, AHL affiliate in the first round when we took out their NHL affiliate, Detroit. So, <laughs> yeah, give or take. Looks like the awards have been posted, but uh, we'll, we'll get into that after. So it looks like Druin won the Calder, and Nash, Rick Nash, won the Hart Memorial. Really? Wow. That was unexpected. Um <laughs> Yeah, we'll see what happens here. I just want to uh, sim. Uh, looks like players under contract went down one. So somebody retired. I'm going to say. I'm going to say somebody retired here. Uh, no. Okay, next day. I just want to get into the retired players here. It's not even showing me yet. What is going on? Okay. Anyways, let's do, yeah, let's do progression and then awards and then we'll do retired players, I guess, when we get there. All right. So progression, progress reports. Let's get into it here. So, um, I don't think a whole lot happened. Oh yeah. Never mind. We had some progression. So Barchi went up to an 85. Um, mostly, holy, look at slap shot power went up. Statistical growth has went down, but his natural growth went up. I think statistical growth goes away after the season. So, um, he should actually be better than an 85 because he's got a few minuses here, which should disappear. And then, yeah, he'll be even better. So that's good. Yeah. Like look at hand eye plus one, but because of the statistical growth, he still stayed an 89, but it should go up because I think statistical growth disappears after this season. So he should be an 86, 87. Hopefully that'd be, that'd be great. Uh, Gordon went down. Ugh. I think that's all statistical, though. That's good. Kopecky went down. Matthias went down. Ekman Larson went up to an 87. Holy crap. His passing went plus 8? 96 passing. Oh, my. He's going to be a freaking offensive oh, destroyer next season. Uh, Gotch went down. Huberto went up to an 89. That's all stati or, uh, natural growth, so that's good. Uh, Larson went up to an 86. Nice. That's good. That's good to see. Wow, our defense is going to be so stupid. Uh, Kulikov went up to an 85. He was an 88 in the playoffs, but um, I could see him getting better over the offseason. Uh, Shore went down. Upshaw went down. Uh, good Branson. Actually, I think Shore was an 82, so he, he got better, I think, but went down at the same time or something. Upshaw got worse. Good Branson got worse. Bodker stayed. Fleischman stayed. Mueller stayed. Okay. Yakupov stayed in eight, went back to an 84. That's good. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure how. The, I, I'm still getting used to the the whole progress thing. And then after the after the off season, they get better or worse again. And then that's how they start the season. So uh, let's look at goalies here. Goalie wise, Bernier went up plus seven. Wow, statistical growth plus seven. So he's an 85. I don't know if that's going to stick or not, but that's pretty solid. Uh, let's look at our AHL. So Hauser went up three. Wow. Okay, Dansk didn't get better, but again, off season. Off-season seems to be the key. Uh, all skaters. Lippin went, got better. Cosmichuk got better. Uh, Reinhardt. It says he went up 10, but he didn't. His his overall didn't get better, so I don't know. Barkov got better. Uh, Morrissey got better. Looks like a bunch of our young guys got better, which is good. It's good. It's good. You know? 
That's awesome. Okay, let's go into uh, stats. Yeah, I feel like a bunch of our guys are going to get better, which is obviously we won the Stanley Cup. So uh, let's do the AHL first. Uh, these are all the teams. Team, teams, 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 team. Uh, here we go. So John V. Solenberg Trophy. Uh, that is the player with the most points. Michael Curtis on the... It looks like the Crunch, I believe. Could be wrong. Uh, Lee, Les Cunningham Award. Michael Curtis, most valuable player. Willie Marshall Award went to Laurent Dauphin. Scores the most goals. Dudley Red Garrett Memorial is for the most outstanding rookie. Went to Laurent Dauphin. Uh, Eddie Shore Award went to Cody Cece, best defenseman. Uh, the Allage Baz Bastion Memorial uh, went to Dansk, which is the best goalie. That's good. Uh, Jack A. Butterfield Trophy, Peter Mrazek. Uh, so that's the most valuable player in the Calder Cup. Fred T. Hunt Memorial went to Michael Curtis. Uh, Yannick Dupre Memorial, Ty Stanton. Uh, what is that? Involvement in the community. Okay. Harry Happ Holmes Memorial. Nicholas Fedberg and Ben Bishop. Uh, probably the goalies. Yeah, Los... <coughs> Lowest goals against for the goalies. Calder Cup, Grand Rapids Gift Griffins. Okay, uh, let's get to the NHL. So we won the Cup, obviously. President's Trophy went to St. Louis. Uh, the Clarence Campbell, obviously, is L.A. And then we won the Prince of Wales. Um, Maurice Rocker Richard went to Jeff Carter. Uh, Ted Lindsay, Rick Nash. Frank J. Selk. Uh, Patrice Bergeron, obviously, deserves that. Bill Masterson, Braden Coburn. William M. Jennings, uh, Varlamov. It's kind of, eh. Fewest goals against. Oh, okay, sure. Vesna Trophy, Yaroslav Halak. Oh, nice. Conn Smythe, Jonathan Bernier. Calder Memorial, Jonathan Druin. So, uh, so far we went Robin Leonard, Mark Shifley, Jonathan Druin. Finally played his first season, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> He's been in the NHL for like three years, but whatever. Uh, or both drafted for three years. Lady Bing, Claude Giroux, James Norris, Kevin Shattenkirk. Art Memorial, Rick Nash, and then Art Ross, Sidney Crosby. Oh, really? Crosby won the Art Ross, but didn't win the, the heart. That's a little bit surprising. All right, so I don't really know what my, uh, my I guess, plan of attack is for the draft. I, I wanted to go for a goalie, but I don't even know how good some of them are. You know, like I've tried to scout people, but it just hasn't really, you know, done that well. <laughs> uh, okay, so we got Mark Savard retiring, uh, Crab, Hosa. Hosa, Lindman, Fiddler, uh, Horkoff, uh, Boyle, Boyd Gordon retired. That's who retired from us. Okay, that's not bad. He was a fourth liner. So, uh, Mike Mateo, he was a guy in the AHL. Mm, Jokinen, Cook, Antropov, Nielsen, Richards. Ooh, Brad Richards. It's not good for a New York. Moore, LeCavalier, Pronger. McIntyre, Kelly, uh, not really worth saying. <laughs> uh, Derek Morris, Joe Thornton, Surrey, Brewer, uh, Aginla. Aginla is in Vancouver? What the frick? <laughs> That's weird. Uh, he's, is he from BC? I'm, I'm, I could be wrong, but I, I'm pretty sure he played for the Blazers in junior, I think. I think. Could be mistaken. Jordan 2-2. Commodore, okay. Uh, Goalie-wise, Bashua. <laughs> oh, whoops. How do we... Uh, there we go. Biron and Vokun. Vokun I feel bad for because of the whole uh, blood clot thing going on for him. I hope he gets better and can play. That sucks. It's brutal. Uh, Jaguar. We got Vokun, Jaguar, Biron, and that's about it for uh, goalies. Okay, so we got three draft picks, I believe. I believe we have three. I could be mistaken. Uh, so what do we want here? Um, players on the block, Bernie. Yeah, I'm taking him off. He had a great season. Uh, Barker, we're going to put back on there. Uh, I don't know who we want to... Bernier's, like, totally picked it up. He's uh, He's got to be a starter now. It doesn't even say, but he's got to be a starter. Bureau hasn't really gone. I don't think I signed Bureau, though. Uh, Butler... Dance, Clarks, Ekman, Larson, Fleischman, Good Branson. Uh, I don't know who I want to trade. Huberto, no. Hutchinson, Kopecky, Kosmichuk. I don't know. We got a lot of young talent. I don't think there's anybody I want to trade right now. As of right now. 
literally, I don't think there's anybody I want to trade. Yeah. Maybe Whitney, but that's... I don't know. He had, he had an okay season, I think. What was this season like? Still a four-star. He had 15 points. He's off as a defenseman, so, I mean, whatever. He probably could have done a little bit better, but... Uh, okay, well, yeah, we'll keep it like that. Uh, wants top six defensemen we don't need. Elite goalie would be nice, but probably not going to happen. Starting goalie we don't need anymore. Bernier has proven himself. Uh, we want that. Surplus. Yeah, you know what? I'm up for trading our picks away. Definitely. Okay, yeah, I'm going to keep it like that. There we go. That's all we need. I, I'm completely content with our team right now. I don't think we need to do a whole lot of anything, so. Let's get into the draft here. All right, so we have the 19th and the 28th pick. Um, you know what? I'm going to open... I'm going to try and get a top 10 if we can. I don't... There's no way we're going to get a top whatever, but uh, let's just... 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And we'll... Again, we'll look at the top... I'll do top 5 rookies again that get drafted. So we got Calgary. We got Vancouver. We got New Jersey. We got Winnipeg. Wow bunch of Canadian teams on the bottom there. Uh, Washington, we got Nashville, Dallas, Pittsburgh, San Jose, and Boston. Okay, so those are the top 10. Top 10 picks! Oh, man! Okay. Uh, no offers. Okay, propose. So, uh, I don't... I'd like to get a top 10. We have two draft picks right now, so we could potentially trade them. I'm feeling like, you know... Probably not going to get a top five. So to shoot for maybe Nashville, Dallas, someone in that range. Um, who's What's Dallas? Let's, yeah, let's start with Nashville, see if we can get the sixth pick. I don't know. I don't know how valuable those picks are going to be, though. That's the thing, right? Yeah, like if I were to go like that and then throw in my two firsts, those aren't, those aren't very valuable, you know? Yeah, there's really not... Uh, Eh, it's close. I might be able to get the sixth pick, honestly. It'd be nice to draft, like get a little bit higher in the draft. I don't know what we're going to get, but it's going to be better than a 19th or 28th pick, right? I mean, obviously, we got two picks, and we're giving it up for one pick. Uh, what, what else could I throw in there, though? Uh, skaters matching the block. Let's see if we can throw in some kind of rookie or something here. Uh, Butler, Barker, Gotch. Well, they would take Barker. Uh, we kind of want to get rid of Barker, so. Gotch, Bjugstad, Whitney, Matthias, uh, Howden, Petrovic, Shore. Uh, Yakupov's trade value has gotten a little bit better, which is good. Ekman Larson's shot up. Bar How is Huberto's, like, that terrible? That's ridiculous. <laughs> that makes no sense. He's like, our, he's like our star player. He's 89 overall, and Barchi's... That must mean Barchi's going to shoot up if his uh, trade value is so high. He's got to be able to shoot up. That's got to be what's going on here. Uh, let's see if they'll take Barker. Barker and a first and a first. I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> I, don't, I really don't think so. But, like, they want to get rid of their first, right? So... Uh... Yeah, let's shoot for it. Cam Bar oh, Cam Barker expires. Oh, okay. Okay, maybe Nashville's pick is a little bit less value. Let's see. Wait, did I? No, I just did Nashville. Dallas. Dallas is first pick. Uh, Dallas. They don't want to get rid of their first. Okay, how about uh, Pittsburgh? A uh, Pittsburgh first. Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh first. They got eighth overall. They're mm, really. Wow, they're. This isn't even that much worse than... Hmm, we might be able to get that. Let's see here. Goalies, no players. They want Barker as well, but again, his contract apparently is up, which I did not know. Oh, we got a lot of guys with contracts up. Oh, my God. It's going to be the longest re-sign phase again. Oh, it's so frustrating. <laughs> it's so frustrating to deal with that. Okay, so we literally, the only person we could trade was Gotch. Gotchies. Bjugstad. I kind of want to keep Bjugstad, though, because um, he's slowly getting better. He's a three and a half star, but, you know, he's already a 77. He's 23, so he could shoot up a little bit. I think he led our HL team, too, so. Whitney. Eh, I could trade Whitney. I don't know what kind of D we got coming up, though. That's a thing. Or we could sign a D. He is kind of expensive. He's 3.1 million for. Yeah, let's throw Whitney in there. See if they take him. 
Whitney, and these for the first. Let's try. Uh, yeah, let's just, you know what? Let's just go for it. I don't think it's going to happen, but whatever. If we don't get it, we don't get it. Oh, we got it. Look at that. Look at that. We got eighth pick. There we go. Hey, you know what? For you guys saying, that was a pretty good trade. You know, I gave up Whitney, and I got gave up two firsts to get this pick. So, uh, I don't see that goalie that we were looking at. So, let's see what we can get here. Uh, top 10 right wing and a left defenseman. Okay. What do we got for goalies? Scouted goalies, Markov and LeCavalier. See, this is uh, two and a half stars. He dropped. The, I thought they were both top tens. They definitely dropped. Let's check out the scouting here. What do we got? Uh, George LeCavalier. So he's got... Mm, athletics are pretty good, actually. Fairly accurate. I don't think the potential actually means anything. It might, but... It's hard to tell. Like, I've seen the potentials be a lot different. So, like, his athletic is actually pretty good. Like, his agility and stuff is all 75 or better. That's fairly accurate. His reflexes are all about 70. His puck control is not the greatest, but it's not bad. I'd like to draft another goalie, just in case. Uh, Markov, durability is 80. But, actually, other than that, speed is an uh, agility 76. Uh, I can't tell if he's better or not. I don't think he is. I think, uh, I think LeCavalier is better. George LeCavalier. Yeah, I think he's better. Okay, so there's those two guys. Let's look at uh, the skaters here. I don't think I even looked at these guys. Visa, y Vesa, Yakola, and Tommy Antilla. Um, the only thing I'd probably go for is the defenseman here. Even Ivan uh, Kulishov. He's a big defenseman. Holy moly. Let's see this guy. What does he got here? Uh, acceleration 81, that's good. But as a big guy, his physical is pretty terrible. Deking not that great. Or, uh, deking is not a big deal. But slap shot power 78, speed 79. He could be okay. Eh, I don't know. Uh, what's this right wing like? He's a power forward. We got nothing on him. Okay, we just have his potential. <laughs> I have his potential. That's about it. Uh, nothing on this guy. Okay, that doesn't help me. Yeah, Ivan Kulishov. Yeah, like this. Eh. I think I might go with the goalie. Yeah, that's not really helpful. It's kind of a crapshoot now going into the, into the draft. Honestly, what are the goalies like here? Oh, there's still that. There's this Blake Crosby. We didn't draft. We didn't look at him though. Markov or LeCavalier? I'm feeling LeCavalier, you know? Feeling it. <sighs> Markov's pretty decent, though, too, you know? I'm feeling LeCavalier, yeah. You know what? We're going go to with, we're gonna go with George's LeCavalier. I'm going to pick him. All right, so we got our top ten. I'm going to look at them. Uh, so what is his name? Ozil. I'll just put the first couple letters. Muir. Safro. Uh, Sf Oh, Sveg, Svegrovsky, Washington, Mc, McIver, uh, Nashville had Pana, oh, go back, Pana Karofsky, uh, Dallas had Person, Person, Pittsburgh, who is now ours, is G, LeCave, um, so we got that one. So Florida, we got that number eight pick. San Jose got the Crosby goalie. And Boston took Antilla, who's the other goalie, I think. Uh, oh, no, Antilla was the forward. Okay. I, I, I want to do the top five, but you know what? We'll do the top ten. That's good. Uh, I don't even think we have a second round pick, so I'm not even going to worry about that. Shut down those. That's good. Whatever. Uh, yeah, we don't even have a second round. Do we have a... Uh, quick sim, that's fine. We don't even have a third either. So you know what? I'm not... Uh, I'm just going to do auto-draft for the rest. We don't really have anything else going on. I don't... Oh, we have a round four. You know what? Let's... Yeah, let's do the draft. Let's just do it. Whatever. It'll take just as much time. Let's just go. Just do the auto-draft thing quickly. Uh, let's just pick guys based on their names. <laughs> That's what I'm feeling right now. 
Uh, muscle white. We'll go based. Oh, who's this guy? Left wing sniper. Offensive defenseman. Let's just check him out really fast. Nothing. Okay. Let's take him. <laughs> Let's take him. He looks good. Looks good. Okay, continue. Uh, oh, 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 oh. There's been no trades other than ours. Okay, uh, quick sim. Da -da 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 -da. Nielsen Blanche. Caesar level. My Nathan Rupp. Uh, I like taking young guys too. Who's this guy? Francois. Yeah, let's take this guy. French Canadian from the QM. Looks good. Okay, take him. Uh, okay, cancel. Auto draft. Take somebody else. Uh, some some low some. We got some undrafted guys who have some high. Let's take this guy. Oh, defensive defender. Defender. <laughs> Dwayne Osgood. <laughs> Dwayne Osgood. Sometimes you can tell by their league interest too. I think you can tell if they're like. I think gonna be okay or not. Playmaker, National League rappers. We, yeah. Let's just take this guy. Whatever. That's fine. We'll go off the. We'll go off the chain here. We'll take somebody. Uh, continue. Cancel. They're probably gonna be terrible draft picks, but whatever. Uh, hi. Let's take this one. Chris Van Gilder, six seven, enforcer. Yes. <laughs> Oh my god, that guy is huge. 6 7 enforcer. No one's gonna want to fight him. I'm just gonna throw him first line with Huberto and Barchi. Like, no one's gonna touch the guy. Rumors are flying that Henrik Zetterberg is on the tree block. Really? Nicholas Cronwell, too. Wow, okay. Some Made some news. Wow, really? They made some news, or I made some news by getting the first round? Fucking idiots. Idiots. Okay, uh, contracts. Let's take a look at what we got, and then we'll end the video here. So overall, let's go by age here. All right. So what do we got? Uh, Van Gilder is an 18 year old, 36 overall. <laughs> Belanger, 56. Uh, Alex Peters, I think we drafted before. Osgood, 19, one star. Cantor, 19. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Yetman, I don't even know who that guy is. Perron. Who, I don't even know who we picked here. I think we... I think it was these guys. Yeah, I think that's it. Okay, then we picked that goalie. That's the only thing. We picked that goalie. Le Cavalier. Well, that's not bad. Three and a half stars. Got another goalie. Three and a half gold stars. Oh, Dansk has jumped up to an 83. Huh. Okay. I don't know when that happened. Does that mean other players got better too? Because he was still a 78 last time I checked. So we got... Oh my god, we got Bernier, Dansk, and Markstrom. Oh, jeez. This is going to be a pain in the ass. <laughs> god. Did anyone else get better then? 89, 87, 86, 85, 85, 84, 84, 84, 84, 84, 84, 83, 82. No? Huh. That's weird. Because when I checked, Oscar Dansk was still a 78. So he just shot up randomly, which is... Good, I guess. Good. <laughs> it's good and bad at the same time. Uh, okay, so let's look at the uh, other players here. Okay, what do we got? Oh. Uh, so we're going to go by age. Okay, so Calgary had the first pick. Oh, no, 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 no. Calgary, no. Carolina, Calgary. Okay, there we go. Calgary. So they took Ozzo Lynch. So he's a three and a half. He was first pick. Three and a half green stars, 60 overall. Not that great. Uh, Vancouver had the second pick. Um, they took Muir. I th was he a goalie? Oh no! Ooh, they they got a steal there. How did he not go first? Four and a half gold stars, seventy-one overall. Power forward. Wow, that's a pretty good that's a pretty good pickup. Uh, New Jersey had the next pick. Uh, New Jersey back one. There we go. Okay, they took Savaronov. So four star, fifty-seven. Uh, defensive defender. Washington had the next pick, and they took McIver, I believe his name was. McIver, three and a half gold stars, 59 overall. Uh, Nashville took Ponikarovsky. Yeah, right there. 
Ponikoroski. Uh, right there. Four red stars, 58. Okay. Decent, I guess. He's a uh, power or playmaker. Person went to Dallas. Oh, Dallas took a person guy. Uh, where is he? Person, person, person. Wow, McDavid's already 76. That's pretty good. Person, three and a half, 69. Oh, offensive defenseman. Uh, we took LeCavalier, and then San Jose took that Crosby goalie. San Jose, where is he? Where are you? Where are you, San Jose? Okay, Crosby goalie. Uh, three and a half gold, 56. Okay, so he was a little bit better than our goalie, but... And then Boston took the Antilla guy. Uh, Boston took Antilla. I think he's a forward, yeah. Three and a half, yeah. Off. Oh no, he's a defenseman, offensive defenseman. Okay. All right, so there it is. There's our top ten draft picks. I think we got a pretty good pick with uh, Le Cavalier. He's not bad actually. Here, one sec. I want to check him out again. I want to check him out again. Why not? You know, check him out again. Uh, rookie goalies, Le Cavalier. Yeah, you know, three and a half gold star. That's not bad. He could he could potentially be our starter if we figure out what we want to do. Cause I mean, well, Bureau actually will probably be our starter this year. Yeah, I'll probably get rid of. Probably not going to use Hauser at all. Dansk is an 83, which is ridiculous. Man, he got... Look at his... Ah, his glove high is a 96. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at his record, though. 51, 17, and 0. Son of a biatch. Um, wow. Wow. That's crazy. Okay, so we definitely got some uh, goalies now. Bureau... I mean, we've, we've had a problem with goalies, man. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Should I move Markstrom? Like, he's just, he's not getting better. I feel so bad that he's not. You know, it's kind of a shame, really. Um, he's still a four and a half red star. But we got Oscar Dansk, who's a four gold star. And he's getting better, you know. So let me know what you guys think about the goalie situation. Should I put Oscar Dansk as a backup this year? Or should I get rid of Markstrom? Should I keep Markstrom? Should I put Dansk maybe in the uh, AHL for another season or something? Like, I don't even know. I don't even know, guys. Let me know what you guys think. All right, so there's the draft. Um, after a Stanley Cup championship run, we have a couple of guys to re-sign, it looks like. And, uh, yeah, alright. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. It is awesome, and I enjoy it. Alright, thanks for watching, guys.